My question is, how long would it take you to eat a stack of pancakes that high? Mm. You? <laughs> Not for, or, for me. Or Mike and Fiona. <laughs> well, the show's an hour, so we'll get through hour, it, yeah. at least by then. Oh, you yeah. think <laughs> finished it in an hour? <laughs> we I'd take like turns. to try. Both yeah, stacks you're about to one? try. We're about I'd, to start. I'd, I'd like to try, so <laughs> yes, they, they look, look very good. They look pretty good, good yeah. All right, we're going to be getting to that in a moment. We will take it from here. Thank you very much. And speaking of nice little uh, treats and in the fall, oh. we're talking about pumpkin. Everybody's in the Everyone likes pumpkin spice latte and all this. Seasonal Favorite fall treat. Sweet potato casserole. With uh, cranberries. Ooh, yes. that does sound good. Yes, that does. Mine would have to be a caramel apple. Oh. You get a good tart, you know, Granny Smith apple, and dip it in the caramel, and you got to unwrap all the little caramel and like everything like that. when you like fish that. it out of the barrel? Yeah, and when you just, you know, <laughs> grab, yes, and you, and you eat that baby there, so ooh, that's good. So, so ooh, let that's us know good. at SA Life Case Out on Facebook and Twitter, what is your favorite fall treat? And if you have a picture, let us know. And I know you like this right here. These things are addictive. <laughs> They are addictive. It we are is. gearing you up for lunch hour with a potato chip crusted chicken recipe. Do us a flavor, Ellen Zerum, and you are the one that came up with this great idea of the taco, crispy taco flavored potato chips. Yes, I did. You are a finalist in this contest, right? Tell us I what am. happens if you win. So oh. tell us what happens when, when you, you win. win. Because all the San Antonio is going to go vote for you. I hope you're right. <laughs> so if I win, slash when I win, um, not only do these become a permanent lace flavor, but I can win a million dollars. I do win a million dollars. Okay, and now you know that your you, favorite you get TV right. Show host. You know that you know at least a thousand each goes to us. <laughs> I will yeah. send you guys a, unlimited supply of chips. <laughs> yes, right. we got chips. So <laughs> chips are not just for snack time. Right. We're going to make a meal out mm -hmm. of them, right? Yes. Instead of eating the whole bag. Yes. So. I, um, yeah, they, I got a few of these uh, mm -hmm. sent to me, and um, I decided, why don't I use them in some other way and make, like, a lunch or a dinner? So um, I love to cook, so I decided to see if I could do, like, a potato chip crusted chicken. It looks so good, too. Oh, it's, there, it's so good. So um, it's really easy. You just take some chicken breasts, and I mm -hmm. usually pound them so that they're a little bit thinner. Okay. Um, you want to dredge them first. Well, beat your eggs. Yep, good job. <laughs> um, the flour has garlic powder and seasoned salt and pepper and paprika. Okay. So you you're can, doing great. Yeah. Thank you. I'm enjoying right. the chips Enjoy while you're chips. waiting. Yeah. Yeah. doing great. <laughs> <laughs> so okay. you take your chicken and um, you go flour first. Good job. So just a, a typical yeah. dredging, breading yep. situation. And mm -hmm. then you're, eggs. You're, you, get, your, get your chips there. Yeah, you've got okay. to crush some yeah. chips. Okay. Put some in that bag. Okay. I usually just put them in a bag because it's easier. Um, just a few handfuls. Okay. And you can take out your frustration and just crush them. Just Smash crush them. them. Yeah. I'm on it. Okay. Why we picked you for that job. <laughs> what are you sure I said? So voting goes on for another week. Yes. And it, you can vote. You said take out my frustration. I can think good about that. And good job. Good Lord. They're ready. <laughs> Um, yes, you can vote um, until October 8th is when the contest is over. You can mm -hmm. vote at Lays.com every day until then. Okay. Now, if you were going to, uh, just a nice little uh, chicken breast here, and coat them in that. Did you dump those out in you there? You want to dump them in there? Sure, sure. Yeah, here, go, it's going to get a little more. Go. That's perfect. There we go. So, okay. yep. So then eggs, and then, perfect. Nice, go in crispy there. coating. Yep. And then you want to spray the pan. I'm on it. Yep. Okay, so we'll coat the pan. Yep. Perfect. And then that just goes in there. Mm-hmm. How um, long do you uh, cook them? Yeah, Wait. so 400. Okay. For, um, these are thin, so like 30 to 40 minutes. Okay. Uh, usually until the chicken is uh, at 165 internally. Okay. Um, yeah, but then after you put them in the pan, then you drizzle it with some melted butter so that um, the chips don't burn. I like her burn. style. <laughs> We're drizzling. Yeah. yeah. Drizzle, drizzle. So just a little drizzle. Yeah. Do you remember the old cartoon character that used to say, drizzle, drazzle, drazzle, drone? No. I'm Mr. <laughs> Mr. Wizard. Anyone? Anyone? No. No. Uh, you don't even remember that? And the cheese yeah. stands alone. <laughs> Just, you said, never mind. Okay. <laughs> Maybe out there in TV land, some are <laughs> remembering. Ted? Awesome. No Nobody. one here is. <laughs>
Okay. So yeah, four hundred for um, thirty to forty minutes, um, and then you've got this beautiful chicken. I usually just serve it with like a salad because mm -hmm. um, you know it's it could be a little rich depending, mm -hmm. but you can do it with different Especially flavors. With the butter drizzled on it, yeah. right? Um, you do it with different flavors of chips, but obviously these are delicious. Crispy taco. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That sounds fantastic. And very quickly, yes. the way you came up with this whole flavor because sure. of your husband? My fiance. Yeah, um, her fiance. So we're getting married in March, but oh, um, congratulations. thank you. Um, he, this is the first, Crispy Taco is the first meal that I cooked for him when we first started dating. And um, I kind of messed it up because I was so nervous. I didn't have any of the ingredients and my taco shells were broken. It was just a hot mess. So uh, when I entered the contest, um, this is the first thing I thought of. And yeah, here we are. <laughs> Look at that. It'd be so great if you win. I yes, know. when? When you win. Yes. All right. When? For more information, to vote for my crispy taco flavor, <laughs> just head to salive.com and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. And they are, you know, again, we have tried the other ones that are the finalists. We don't even care what they are. Literally, and I'm not just saying that, those are the best. <laughs> right, though, no, they are really they good. They are fantastic. All okay. right, from savory to sweet, this spot will definitely satisfy your sweet tooth craving. Yes, indeed. It is called Pancake Joe's, and literally a top secret recipe. Mm -hmm. It's something called the cinnamon roll pancake. <laughs> David Elder gives us the view. David Elder with SA Live. Well, I'm out here at a place that's making traditional family-made pancakes. They won't tell you the secret recipe, but let me tell you, the food is fantastic. So we're going to go inside Pancake Joe's and see how they make their famous pancakes. Pancake Joe's is a must-visit destination for breakfast lovers in the Alamo City. Our customers, our regulars that are here will wait hours and hours. Their selection is straightforward and their food is authentic. I cook, my mom cooks, my dad cooks, uh, my sister's learning how to cook as well. And the best part, their pancakes are amazing. Don't do it to them. Oh, it's hot. Ooh, look at that steam coming off the pancake. Chef owner Jose Cruz opened the breakfast joint eight years ago because of his passion for cooking, and he wanted to leave behind a legacy for his daughters. My father, my number one guy, my hero, he, um, he just always loved cooking. He's always loved cooking, and he's just always wanted to leave a legacy behind because he has three girls, and he wanted to make sure that they were taken care of with or without a man. You know, it just comes with having three girls. The diner specializes in traditional breakfast items like waffles. Mm. I love how fluffy the waffle is. And omelets. If you love omelets, then you know you got to come out here and try this one. This is the chorizo omelet. You saw how they made it. It looks very southwest. looks very... And you can just... You can just smell it and be okay. Feta cheese. That's what it is. The feta sets it over the top. Their namesake is the pancake and for good reason. Their pancakes are light, fluffy, and huge. They have a secret pancake recipe that they won't share. And if you're feeling adventurous, they offer their cinnamon roll pancakes. Their cinnamon roll pancake, cinnamon inside the middle of this thing, and there's icing on top. Pancakes, sweet things, sweet pancakes. That tastes like a cinnamon roll. The food is delicious, and the customers keep coming back for more. Uh, the food's always hot. The service is great. The food's is quality. I mean, it's, it's really great here. Oh, man, Pancake Joe's is the best. Feeling hungry? The Cowboy Breakfast is built for the hungriest of diners. And we're going to be trying here. This is the Cowboy Breakfast. You can see it's three biscuits, homemade gravy, three sunny-side-up eggs, and bacon. If I had to pick one, <laughs> it would be the Cowboy Breakfast. This is what Kevin would take on his private island if he had only one thing to eat for the rest of his life. That's just good. Really good. There are two locations of Pancake Joe's here in San Antonio, including the newer location off Ingram Road. So come out to Pancake Joe's. Because they got you Joe, right here, they got your cup of Joe. And they got your pancakes. And it's all delicious, authentic food. And it's run by a nice family out here. You guys gotta come check it out if you haven't already. Food's fantastic, it's delicious, and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna take a nap right now. For SA Live, I love these people. I'm David Elder. Ah uh, yes, David Elder, eating oh. his way through San Antonio and probably sleeping in a booth near you. I know, look at these. <laughs> You know, and just the the smell coming off these pancakes. Okay, this is the cinnamon roll pancake mm -hmm. over here. There you go. Look at that. Oh, yeah. You're going to try that? That's the secret recipe. The uber secret sworn to totally under wraps. How is it? So good. <laughs> All right.
right. <laughs> All right, coming up on the show while Mike eats his way through this hour. All natural and organic beauty products your body will love. We're sharing three affordable products that are eco-friendly next. And tis the season for pumpkin spice everything. Pumpkin pops recipe for the kiddos a little bit later on in the show. So stay with us. Click and save with five-star coupons at myfivestarcleaners.com. My Five Star Cleaners, My Five Star Value. Hi, I'm Jeff Roper along with Alexander Castillo. We want to tell you about some great news from Slametica. And if you've wanted to lose weight, if you wanted to feel better about yourself on the inside and the outside, you have the answers. I do. We have a special recipe for weight loss success at Slametica where we help our patients lose around half a pound to a pound a day. Whoa, 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 whoa. Half a pound to a pound a day? Yes, and it's all without exercise. And this is with European technology. The Zorona laser does it with a cold laser effect, doesn't it? It's incredible. It's completely painless and non-invasive, so there's no downtime with it whatsoever. You can come in and relax, and you'll be burning fat and inches off at the same time. I felt the laser. It's kind of a tickling sensation, but it also relaxes you, and you can do this over your lunch. Break, right? You can, because it only takes 40 minutes under the laser, so it's not very time consuming. And you're working with a doctor too, right? Yes, our program is medically supervised and not a one size fits all, it is tailored for each patient. Because everybody's different and everybody needs to lose weight in certain areas too. Exactly, the Zorona laser is great for a spot target, so any troubled area that you have, you can come on in and we'll get those inches off for now you. I asked if you can fix ugly and you told me no, but we can, <laughs> because you can't fix this, but we can tighten things up too. There's so many great things about Slametica, you owe it to yourself to get a consultation to find out more to get a program catered to you and your needs especially now as we head toward the holidays exactly it does work very quick so fast that we do guarantee an overall four inch loss just within the first two weeks of starting the treatment did you us. hear that you said four inches guaranteed four inches guaranteed you're gonna have to buy new clothes this is how this works you'll probably have to buy a whole new wardrobe Alex we're gonna put the special offer up on the screen right now and I know what you're saying you're saying to yourself self do I need to look at the screen? Yes, you do, because 50% off of this special offer and an added incentive. Two free hair removal sessions on a small area. Wow. So not only are you going to make your life easier because you don't have to shave anymore, and you're going to feel better, and you're going to look better, plus you get to buy new clothes. Exactly. And it's all doctor supervised. It's Slamedica.com. Call or text now. The number's on the screen and take advantage of this special offer. Hey, Dad, what's up? Checking out the newansera.com website. It looks great and even easier to check out all the cars, trucks, and RVs. And great low prices, too. Everyone should think ansera.com. Think Ansera. On the go with the KSAT app. Expect to know. Swipe through today's latest stories. Watch newscasts live. And when news breaks, expect an alert on your phone. The KSAT app in partnership with Ansera. Download or update for free today. good about what you're putting on your skin with organic beauty products. Here are some recommendations of style and beauty expert Donna Kim from DonnaDaily.com. Um, hey. All right. Now, <laughs> we've got some, some products here that are from Europe, right? Yes. yes. So okay. I'm really excited. I love this line. Mm -hmm. This is from Lumina. Mm -hmm. um, it's available at Walmart now. It's an, This is from, a fin, from Finland. Oh, Scandinavia. Yes. Okay. There we go. So we're going to focus on the Classico collection. This is the night cream that I think you would just love because... It has Arctic spring water and a cotton grass, Nordic cotton grass. So it's just going to help revitalize your skin, especially when you're sleeping. Mm -hmm. So it's a nice, thick consistency. You put it on before you go to bed, you wake up, and your skin is just totally plump and super refreshed and really hydrated. And you can get it at Walmart, and the night cream is $11. $11. Now, this is the whole collection, right? Yes. So it's got everything, cleansers, toners. Yes. So you can just go to Walmart. You can just pick it up. You can get everything, and you're not spending a whole ton of money. I love that. Yeah. Okay. All right. What do we have here? So next is the Dr. Ha Dr. Hauschka Volume Mascara. Um, this formula is made with Natru, which is organic and natural, and the formula is really volumizing. I can tell you love mascara, so this oh, could yeah. be amazing. <laughs> yes, on this show, yes. So yes. Okay. And it It's really important to be mindful to um, use organic beauty products on your eyes because mm -hmm. they're your eyes. So you want to make sure that the ingredients are going to um, help strengthen them, not only just make them look pretty. Well, yes, and I mean, it's such a sensitive area as well, so yes. you don't want all the chemicals and pollutants and everything right by your Jeepers Creepers Peepers. And you can get this at Whole Foods. 
Those are at Whole Foods? Yeah. And about how much do these That are? is $28. $28. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. And so lastly, we have the RMS Beauty Luminizer X Quad. So, um, contour is out. The non-tour is in. It's all about highlighting those cheekbones. What are the Kardashians going to do? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> They're going to is out? They are. It really is. This, it's all about highlighting and strobing and um, RMS Beauty. Actually, it's um, a pure and organic color cosmetic line. So, this is totally organic. And um, it just provides the best pigment. Do you want to try it? Okay. Mm-hmm. So this is... So these are all highlighters, mm-hmm. um, and you know, you can just put it wherever you like. I like to put it on the bridge of my nose, mm-hmm. and then on uh, the top of my cheekbones. Like that? There we there. go. <laughs> is it shimmering? It's pretty shimmering. shimmering. <laughs> it's beautiful. It's beautiful. So yeah, that's um, $48, and you can get that at rmsbeauty.com. All right. Great stuff from Donna Kim from DonnaDaily.com. For more information on her and all these products, just head to our website, salive.com, and click on the As Seen on SA Live tab. All right, how a pair of shoes can change a person's life. New Balance San Antonio is here to tell you how you can get involved and help a person in need. Plus, looking for something to do with the kids this weekend? We're taking you to the Magic Theater for a preview of their kid-friendly show, Ricky Ticky Tabby. Stay with us. He's already been sentenced. I don't care. Go. This vet claimed he couldn't walk and collected hundreds of thousands of dollars from the VA. I'm innocent. In July, a defender's investigation exposed the truce. I saw him bend down to pick it up. I can't even scratch my own nose. Two paralyzed veterans got involved, helping to sentence him to 27 months in prison. And... Cole must pay back the government more than $434,000. Expect the defenders to hold them accountable. Bad things happen, but sometimes they can be devastating. If you've been hurt in a car crash, you don't have to feel powerless. Call 777-HURT for a free consultation. At the Arial and Begum, we fight for you. It's John Wayne's Spring Clean Save Green promotion. Wait! I know spring has ended, but this promotion hasn't. Due to the overwhelming response of this offer, it's back as our end of summer special. Save lots of cash on a complete AC system, starting at only $59 a month. Call John Wayne now and spend the last days of summer in cool comfort for only $59 a month. Plus, with this offer, we'll clean all the ducts in your entire home for free. Call John Wayne today to see if you qualify at 293-6700. Some prove age is not a limit. I'm excited to continue embracing the unknown. I fight more than ever for my charity. The more I live, the younger I am. Advanced Genifique by Lancome. Every serum drop infuses youthful radiance throughout the skin. Patented until 2029. Advanced Genifique. Lancome. Customize your free 7 Bs gift. Available now at Dillard's. This is Justin, and Sarah, and Joe. This is where they work. They, along with a few hundred of their co-workers, make up the Jefferson Bank community crew. And this is what they do, tirelessly giving their time and energy to make our communities better places to live. Because at Jefferson Bank, this is personal to us. And this is our future. Do you have a long-lasting sore in your leg that is not healing? You might be suffering from venous leg ulcer. Dr. Morris Stribling has partnered with Element Research Group for a venous leg ulcer research study. Qualified patients may receive study-related medical attention and travel compensation. Please call Dr. Stribling at 210-303-2007. The number again, 210-303-2007. Most people think big insurance companies are there to protect them. It's just not true. If you've been hurt in a car crash, you need someone on your side ready to fight. Call 777-HURT for a free consultation. At the Arial and Begum, we fight for you. Welcome back, everybody. Well, you got an old pair of gym shoes that don't fit anymore. They're kind of worn out. Got a great idea what you can do with them. And that is not a trash barrel. It is going to a very good cause. Rob Kaufman from New Balance San Antonio is here, along with Celeste Eggert from Haven for Hope. Mm-hmm. And it is that time of year again, the semi-annual shoe drive. It certainly is. It's, it's a great opportunity to uh, clean out your shoe museum, shoes that have been sitting around, you haven't worn them for a long time. Yeah. Bring them in, and they're going to go 
to, to Haven for Hope for the for the uh, residents of Haven for Hope. And yeah, I think somebody's been cutting the grass in these. But yeah. anyway, yeah, it doesn't matter really what condition they are in, correct? Any condition. Just, just a decent pair of shoes, gently worn it, shoes, right? Any kind of shoes, dress shoes, six inch stilettos, boots, it doesn't really matter. And here's one perfect example where anything, even a good pair of flip-flops, right? Absolutely. We can use these as shower shoes, so they're great. Okay. Um, how many people at Haven for Hope, this obviously, I mean, because people don't think about a, a pair of shoes is just one of those necessities. You it's just a basic put necessity about. that people just take for granted. How many people do you serve? We there? have about 1,700 people on our campus mm -hmm. each day, including of 150 children from age newborn to age 18. And you said a lot of people come in and they have nothing, right? Nothing. They mm -hmm. might have the clothes on their back and a pair of shoes that probably are torn and worn. Um, so any new shoes, any shoes like this are greatly appreciated. And don't worry about size, because with 1,700 people, there's somebody that they're gonna fit. <laughs> and, you, and you talk about kids' shoes, too, because if you had kids, you know that they grow out of them uh, by the time you get them out of the box, basically. Mm -hmm. So just bring those in. And the nice thing is, when you go to New Balance, and they don't have to be New Balance shoes at all, but any shoe, any shoes, and when you come in, uh, we'll give you a $20 uh, coupon that you can use towards uh, apparel or towards shoes, mm -hmm. anything in the store. And you said that a lot of people just come in after they clean out the closet and go, here, just take them. Yeah, I need the space for some more shoes that we're going to give, get away from in a few more years. Yeah, But, but a lot of people are just like, here, I, I just want to donate to it, right? Exactly. Yeah, just, it's a great cause. and. We recognize the need. And, and we were just talking about this. It's one of those, those giving situations where it doesn't go through all the different channels and everything like that. It's literally, you know, somebody has got a, a decent pair of shoes on their feet, right? Absolutely. And we are so grateful to New Balance and Rob for doing this for us. It's a great opportunity to help people who are in need in our community. Okay. Um, with the 1,700 people, they... Like I said, that's on a, on a daily basis, but you keep getting people in every single day, new people coming in. So this is one of those needs that is continual, right? Even it's, more than just a semi-annual basis. Absolutely. Okay. The need exists year round. I will say with colder weather coming up, um, we do need shoes like this uh, more so than we would in the summertime. Okay, so we always talk about spring cleaning, but the shoe drive is going on right now. Starts today, starts today. Yes, it starts today through the 15th. So for the next couple of weeks, this is your incentive. Right. We got some rain coming in the next couple of days, so you get into your closet, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. clean it out, hope for new clothes for <laughs> yep. all, all the Christmas and the holidays and everything like that, yeah. and donate here. And these barrels are going to be at your stores, correct? Right. No. So and we, we want to we want to fill them up and then some, and we yeah. usually do. And of course, you've got the three locations where we, uh, at the Strand on Hebner and Ten. Uh, Quarry Village, Bassey Road, and the Forum on 35 and 1604. Okay, and once again, for more information on how you can be a part of this shoe drive, visit NewBalanceSanAntonio.com or visit any one of those locations. Once again, Hebner Road, Agora Parkway, or on East Bassey. Celeste, thank you very thank much. You. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks Appreciate it. it. Thank you. All right, coming up, coming? it is a kidly theater experience that the parents will enjoy too. We're going to take you out to Magic Theater where they're about to start a new show called... You know the name, Ricky Tiki Tavi. And celebrate the start of October with a pumpkin spice. We're going to show you how to make a pumpkin spice martini. Hey, <laughs> yes, indeed. And it's good. That's coming up. If you have any questions about VA home loan eligibility, call me now and I'll answer all your questions. And thank you for serving our country. There's nothing more stressful than an unexpected AC or plumbing this bill. But with the Buyer Boys No Hassle $25 service call, you pay only $25 for an AC or plumbing service call with a repair. Call the Buyer Boys, bending over backwards for South Texas for almost 25 years. If your nose runs constantly, you always have a tissue with you and nothing ever seems to help, then you might be a candidate for a new leading edge treatment called Clarifix. I'm Dr. James Atkins. I've been diagnosing and treating sinus problems for over 25 years. I recently helped develop Clarifix, a non-invasive, in-office treatment for runny nose, stuffiness, and nasal congestion. If you suffer from sinus problems, come see us at the Texas Sinus Center. Because we aren't waiting on new technologies, we are developing them. Look at this! Look at the, the Texas Hammer! Seriously hurt in a car accident? I hammer the insurance companies for you! My client was in a car accident and needed surgery! I got him $440,000 in his pocket! 
Call me now. I'm Bill Adler, the Texas Hammer. Call now. Time is critical. Call 210-531-0000. 210-531-0000. Now's the right time to make stylish upgrades at Haverty's Furniture. Through October 9th, save up to $1,000 in bonus discounts. And take advantage of no interest for 36 months. Find pieces with a personality bold enough to match your own. With Haverty's, your home can be perfect, even when life isn't. We're early. Hurry in now to save up to $1,000 in bonus discounts at Haverty's. Life looks good. Ladies and gentlemen, Miss Tanya Tucker. Tanya Tucker in concert, October 7th at the House Pasture Cattle Company in Concan. Plus, fall on the Frio Barbecue Cook-Off, the River Road Market Fest, and Birdie Golf Tournament at the Golf Club of Texas in Concan. October 6th and 7th. For tickets and lodging, go to visit uvaldecounty.com. If you need a new AC system, don't stress out. Call the Bar Boys. With approved credit, you can get a complete AC and heating system from the Bar Boys with 18 months, no interest, no payments financing. Call the Bar Boys today, 656-9027. Day. What's better than spending some story time with your family? I know my children love story time in our house, and today we are at the Magic Theater where the stories come to life. And this month you can catch Ricky Tiki Tavi. Joining me is Francis Lemoncelli, the artistic director. Now tell me about Ricky Tiki Tavi. Well, it's some classic literature. Because uh, one thing people may not know about the Magic Theater, they might know we're fun and entertaining and do popular books on stage like Junie B. Jones and Pink Delicious, right. but we also do some classic literature. We want to expose children to great literature in an educational and fun forum. So Ricky Tiki Tavi is by Rudyard Kipling, who wrote The Jungle Book. Everybody loves The Jungle yes. Book. And this story has several stories in it. It's Ricky Tiki Tavi, who's this brave mongoose who defeats an evil cobra. Uh, but there are also some of his just so stories in there, like how the elephant got its trunk, how the camel got its hump. Uh, so there's sort of his take on folk tales. Um, so what are some of the reactions when children come and see these stories come to life that you see? It's wonderful because many of the children have read the book beforehand, but I think the majority have not. Okay. And the lines to buy the book after the show are always big, and that makes me feel great because it means families are going to take that book home. They're going to read it together at bedtime. They're going to remember the show and, and pay attention to the words in the story and getting families reading together. One of the special things about this show are these magnificent headpieces yes. because we have only four actors and they're playing something like 13 different characters, oh most gosh. of them different animals. And so they won't be making full changes. Instead, each animal will have this really fantastic animal headpiece that indicates who they are. Now we open in a few days, so these ma these headpieces aren't finished yet. They're going to be painted. We have a design by Carolyn Dellinger who has created, we wow. see baboons and camels and cobras and birds and elephants. And here we have Jovi Lee as the elephant, the elephant's child who doesn't have a trunk yet. And you can see that with elastic, Ooh. this trunk gets pulled oh, out into a whole <laughs> long trunk. And we were even thinking the kind of foam these, that these masks are made of is a very common craft foam that you can get at a craft store. And moms could even try something like this themselves just by putting a little elastic oh, yeah. in time there. For exactly. DIY. Yes. How cute are you? <laughs> yes. So opening is this Friday night, October 6th at 6:30, and we always try to make opening night special. So even though we run for a month, if you come opening, uh, you'll get to do a craft. Ooh. You'll meet the actors before the show oh, in nice. costume. You'll get to uh, play a game, maybe even learn a little dance on the oh. stage. Some we're doing some traditional Indian dance in the play. Uh, right, because Rudyard Kipling uh, lived in colonial India, so we are taking everybody to India with this show. Hey, stories come to life here at the Magic Theater, and I think it's time for a scene. scene. A scene. Okay. So 
Tiki Tiki Tavi is just a baby mongoose who hasn't learned how to fight cobras yet. But because this cobra wants to kill his owners, the mother and child that he lives mm. with, he has to save them. That's to. pretty important, right? Yes, of course. So he's got to grow up really fast mm. and fight this big cobra. And just as he was readying himself for the killing blow. <laughs> Well, this is the tallest I've ever been. Don't forget the show is this Friday at 6.30. And for more information, just head to magictheater.org. That's magic with the K. And I'm about to learn a dance move. Joby, what are yes, we learning? Absolutely. You're going to learn our camel dance. So you're going to make your right arm the camel's face. Okay. Put your left arm down. Again, you can catch Ricky Tiki Tavi and other Just So stories at the Magic Theater October 6th through November 4th. You can find more information by calling 227-2751 or head to magictheater.org. All right, sugar and spice and everything pumpkin flavored. We're taking your traditional pumpkin spice recipes and turning them into cake pops. And earlier we asked you, what's your favorite fall treat? Vanessa says, oh, she's like you. She's like you, caramel apples. Are wonderful. <laughs> Keep them coming. Download the BGC app today, powered by Dr. Phone's professional smartphone and tablet repair. Nobody gets your carpet, tile, or hardwood as clean and healthy as Stanley Steamer. That's why I call. Call or schedule online. Three rooms of carpet, only $99. Stanley Steamer, your certified cleaner. The world's biggest spa sale. 1,200 spas, five manufacturers, 10 locations. Vacation at home. $5,000 spas now, $24.99. Going on now at Family Leisure. A Texas legend, a San Antonio icon, power lawyer Wayne Wright. Cowboy Tough, 30 years experience, winning clients the most money possible. Wayne Wright won my case. Car or company truck wreck injury. Get the right lawyer right now, right here in San Antonio. Wayne Wright won my case. Wayne Wright Injury Lawyers, getting justice, getting you what's yours. Wayne Wright's famous for helping injured people in San Antonio. Call power lawyer Wayne Wright, 888-8888. Old McGimmick had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Here a gimmick, there a gimmick, E-I-E-I, no. But on this farm we've got the facts, E-I-E-I-O. With some common sense here and some hearty food there. Here a chicken, there a chicken, everywhere a happy chicken, E-I-E-I-O. Sanderson Farms, good, honest chicken. Since 1945, Lewis Shanks has been offering you the finest in home furnishings. Rugs, lighting, accessories, and more. Each in the style that fits you. If you're looking for the timeless elegance of traditional furnishings, or if a casual look is a bit more your speed, or if that contemporary design matches your decor, you'll find the perfect piece from Lewis Shanks' vast selection of all styles, each as unique as you. Lewis Shanks will make you feel right at home. Did you know that you can turn your car and your title into cash with Title Max in as little as 30 minutes? Call 1-88-TITLE-MAX or go to TitleMax.com now to find out how much you can get. $3,000. $2,600. Title Max turned my title into $10,000. Call 1-88-TITLE-MAX or go to TitleMax.com and find out how much cash you can get. And you'll say, I got my title back with Title Max. It's a title back. The California loans made by Title Max of California Incorporated. California Finance Lender Law License Number 603-K014. If you broke it, we can fix it. No need to take time off to get your phone fixed. Call today and we'll send out one of our state-of-the-art phone ambulances to handle your phone emergency. Call Dr. Phones at 377-1010 today. Leslie Mouton on Good Morning San Antonio from 4.30 to 7. Welcome back. Well, tis the season for pumpkin spice everything and everything nice chef rebecca henry is here with a pumpkin pop recipe to satisfy your pumpkin spice craving thanks so yep. much for being here thank you for having me is this really a healthy twist on a pumpkin pop 
It sure is, if not just a less guilty option. I like that too. You're using when the, I hear less guilty, I think healthier. <laughs> you can feel a little bit better about it. So this is using the Holy Wholesome Organic Traditional Pie Dough. Okay. So it's all natural, organic. The brand's fantastic. It's got whole wheat, gluten-free, even spelt flour options. So any filling you want, you can feel a little bit better about it. Okay. And you have the this inside yes, those, right? Now, yes. tell us what is in this recipe? So it smells this amazing. is canned pumpkin, mm -hmm. sweetened condensed milk, brown sugar, salt, uh, eggs, cinnamon, ginger, and cloves. And if you go to the Lavish Cuisine Facebook, we have the detailed instructions up there for you. Okay. All right. So how do we get started? So okay. we've got we've got this out, right? Yes. So you're going to let this dough thaw because you find it in the freezer section mm -hmm. of your HEB, Sprouts, Whole Foods, or Natural Growers. And then you're going to let it thaw. You're going to use a cookie cutter or a mason jar lid. <laughs> <laughs> and you're going to cut out the recipe. There we go. There you okay. go. And you're going to cut out an even number mm -hmm. of circles. Okay. So you just push. And I love this little plastic sheet that it comes with because it's no mess. Okay. And then once you have all of your circles, you're going to take a lollipop stick mm -hmm. and you're going to place it a good three quarters of a way up the circle. So that way it's nice and sturdy and you don't have to worry about it falling off. Okay. And then after that, you're going to take a nice dollop of the filling. Okay. And probably about a tablespoon, if you're a chronic overfiller like I am, <laughs> it yeah, might we are. spill over. Have you seen this show? <laughs> we like so, everything in excess. <laughs> okay, so about that? Yeah, yeah that might be a bit, bit too, much, too much. But what Ooh. you can do is Ooh. you're going to stretch the top a little bit. Okay. So you stretch the top half. And then you're going to place it over and try to seal it in. And okay. if it spills out, it's really no big deal. You can just wipe this it off. This is more for you to lick. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Exactly. And then you're going to take your fork uh -huh. and you're going to crimp the edges to seal it all in like this. And then once you have it all sealed. So it's like a little pumpkin pie on a stick. It is. Exactly. Okay, and so we'll go then a little less on the next one. Okay, you can on. do a little bit less. So and let's then, try, let's try that. That looks perfect. So then you can go ahead and stretch mm -hmm. out the top a little bit. Okay. And lay it over. Okay. Then lay it over. Mm -hmm. okay. And then you're going to crimp it to seal it in. There. And then you're going to take, you could probably do it with your fork as well, but you mm -hmm. can take a knife and just so the air can escape so they don't explode in the oven, you're just going to prick the top a couple of times. Like a little pie? Yes, exactly. And then you're going to put those in a 425 degree oven for about 15 minutes until they're nice and golden brown. And, and then, then you can do some drizzle. You can do some white chocolate, dark chocolate. You can and make I them look real this. pretty. I love how they're displayed. It's perfect for entertaining. Halloween's coming here up. Comes, here comes the hand. <laughs> here comes the hand from nowhere. Sneak in a pie pop. <laughs> <laughs> I recognize that hand anywhere. <laughs> Honestly, these would be great for even getting your kids in the kitchen to help make Make these, they probably love it. It'd oh, be a nice yeah, I mean, that activity. was fun alone, even when it does spill out. You know, kids love the mess, no in, mess in the kitchen, you know. <laughs> All right, and there are some other ideas, right, because it's National Dessert Month on, yes. on other things you can make for the season? Yes, well, apple pie, honestly, I think is good any time of year, not mm -hmm. just the summertime. So you could pick any of these wholly wholesome pie crusts for whatever your dietary preference is. And you could do a nice apple pie. You could do a cherry pie. I actually did a quiche this morning for a client with the whole wheat crust. So you could really choose any kind of filling that you want and just... <laughs> How are you like it, it? It's, it's, it's not as guilty, too. Yes. Well, Gluten-free. But not even that. I like mm. the fact that it's not even just a big whole slice of pumpkin pie. It's it's the perfect little amount. It's the, it's the yeah. perfect amount. Exactly. And this way you can eat a scoop of ice cream with it, too. <laughs> and you really don't <laughs> feel guilty, right? Now we need to work right? on filling them with so ice cream. this time of day. Look at you taking it to the next level. All right. Great stuff this from Chef great. Rebecca oh, Henry. I love it. Thank For you. For this recipe and more, just head to our website, salive.com, and click on the As Seen on essay live tab all right we continue with the pumpkin spice trend but this time <laughs> with one of my favorite ingredients a dash of vodka <laughs> and we're sharing a sweet pumpkin spice martini recipe and tomorrow on essay live did you know there's a firefighting museum right in san antonio mike takes you inside this unique place with a lot of history and family fun that's tomorrow at one Next time you need a plumber, trust Primo Plumbing and see what our customers are saying at PrimoPlumbingInc.com. State your claim with Wayne Wright Injury Lawyers. Motorcycle accident, fractured kneecap, and shoulder injury. Wayne Wright got me $208,264. State your claim. Call Wayne Wright Injury Lawyers now. 
It's John Wayne Spring Clean Save Green promotion. Wait! I know spring has ended, but this promotion hasn't. Due to the overwhelming response of this offer, it's back as our end of summer special. Save lots of cash on a complete AC system, starting at only $59 a month. Call John Wayne now and spend the last days of summer in cool comfort for only $59 a month. Plus, with this offer, we'll clean all the ducts in your entire home for free. Call John Wayne today to see if you qualify at 293-6700. Today's the day to eat, bowl, and play at Main Event. Over 130 of today's hottest video games. Chef-inspired dining in a high-energy bar with big-screen TVs. Bowling, billiards, laser tag, and more. It's the most... President, the First Lady, Vice President, Karen Pence, heading back into the White House now after observing that moment of silence for the 58 dead, 515 wounded in that shooting in Las Vegas last night at a country music festival. Your White House staff flanked there on the lawn of the White House as well. I'm here with our chief investigative correspondent, Brian Ross. And Brian, we're learning much more now about the shooter, Stephen Paddock, 64 years old. According to police, he acted alone, killed himself, as police came upon his room in the Mandalay Bay Hotel, still searching for a motive. That remains a mystery. We do know he spent several weeks stockpiling weapons and ammunition, made his plans carefully, had somehow obtained a very hard to obtain uh, automatic weapon, which he used in his attack. But for this moment of evil, he was a very unremarkable person. At age 64, he had moved to a retirement community outside Las Vegas. Uh, his brother has described him as somebody who was not political, not part of any religion, not a white supremacist, was a man who had some money and lived mostly to play video poker, according to his brother, Eric. Unremarkable, perhaps, but senior justice correspondent Pierre Thomas, a man who had built up quite an arsenal, 19 guns, according to your sources, in that hotel room that we see he blew the window out of right there. George, he came armed to kill uh, multiple multiple guns as you said our source is telling us roughly 20 guns 19 one specifically told me uh, that he had uh, in that room as he fired down upon those unsuspecting uh, people trying to enjoy a beautiful Sunday night uh, of a concert George again law enforcement t right now trying to determine where those guns came from uh, trying to determine if they were bought automatic, some of them, if they were augmented to become automatic. Right now, huge investigation underway looking at this man's background. No f ties to international terrorism so far. Nothing remarkable in his criminal background to suggest he would do anything like this so far, George. And the authorities have knocked down the FBI agent in charge on the scene, has knocked down a claim of responsibility on an ISIS website. I want to go to Matt Gutman on the scene. You've been reporting, reporting all through the night, all through the day, Matt. This was a scene of pure terror and panic that unfolded at about 10.07 Las Vegas time. George, we were just inside that hotel, the Mandalay, moments ago, and we were able to see down into that concert venue what we saw was incredibly disturbing. The debris of what hundreds and thousands of people left behind, lawn chairs, of course, there were still stretchers there, it looked like bandages on the ground. And perhaps what was most astounding was the distance between where that shooter was perched on the 32nd floor, all the way on that far side of the building, to the concert venue several hundred yards away and we think of 
the mass amount of bullets and rounds fired into there, you think that some of them must have missed. It was deadly accurate, all the more astonishing given how the vast distance between those two sites and the types of weapons that we think or police say that he was using, those uh, AR-type rifles. Um, just a very disturbing sight to see right now. There are still uh, first responders going through there, combing through, and obviously forensics teams trying to find whatever evidence they can or just uh, pick up whatever pieces they can and, and any additional evidence. George. Surveillance video likely to pick up more evidence in the coming days as well. And of course, this moment of silence for the victims of this massacre. Lindsay Davis has been at the University Hospital Center in Las Vegas where they took in about 100 of those victims. And Lindsay, you've got every hospital in the Las Vegas area dealing with this trauma. Of course, because we're talking about 515 people injured, just to give you an idea of where we are. So we just moved a little bit away, but UMC is just across the street over here. And then in this parking lot here, they brought in a bunch of RVs, and this is just a pop-up impromptu uh, blood drive. And just to give you a sense of that, uh, at some of the locations, we're told there's a five-hour wait. At this location, they're at capacity. So if you haven't already registered, they can't even take any more blood. It's just one way uh, that the community community is rallying around the victims. Just across the street, we have about a dozen people uh, still fighting for their lives, 12 people still in critical condition, George. So many fighting for their lives, and the trauma from this day is going to last well beyond uh, today as well. The psychological trauma for the families of the victims, for those victims, for those who are on the scene, Lindsay. Uh, you're exactly right, and I think that that's the large thing that is so impressive about the community is that they're eager to do whatever it takes. There's a GoFundMe page that they're, they're giving donations to the victims. Uh, there are people who have signs with uh, free water. They're bringing free food. There are free charging stations. Uh, just trying to erase some of the ugliness of, of the day. Okay, thank you, Lindsay Davis. Cecilia Vega, our senior White House correspondent. No words from the president at that moment of silence honoring the victims early in the day. He did called this an act of pure evil and called on all Americans to come together at this moment. Yeah, George, the White House is saying that this is a day for consoling the survivors, for uniting this country. Uh, as you said, no words from the president there, there in that moment of silence. He has ordered all of the flags around this country flying on federal buildings, buildings starting here at the White House to fly at half staff today. That is happening. Uh, the White House briefing just ended moments ago, and there were a number of questions in there for Press Secretary Sarah Sanders about the president's position on gun control, given what happened in Las Vegas today. They say this is not the place or the time for political debate, uh, but surely this is a question that will continue to come back at this White House. I also asked Press Secretary Sarah Sanders if the president considers what happened in Las Vegas this morning an act of domestic terrorism. The White House wouldn't say. They say that this is premature, but George, to tell you that this is an emotional moment for those in this White House is an understatement. Uh, Sarah Sanders today, before she started the question and answer period of this recent briefing, had a very emotional moment at that podium, seemed to tear up as she was talking about the heroic acts that happened there in Las Vegas. And as we've been hearing all through the night, so many acts of heroism in the wake of that massacre. Okay, Cecilia Vega, thanks very much. We're going to go off the air right now. We'll be back with breaking news. You can also get breaking news anytime by downloading the ABC News app and David Muir in Las Vegas tonight for a special edition of World News. Have a good day. This has been a special report from ABC News. AT&T Center, Sunday, November 12th at 2 p.m. Tuesday on GMSA, what should you do if an employer wants to know about your previous salary? How men and women may want to take different approaches to answering the salary question. Will we see any more fog Tuesday morning? How about any rain? Find out 4.30 to 7 on Good Morning San Antonio. Ready for office furniture? Desk Galore has new and used desks, chairs, file cabinets, bookcases, and much more. We have a big selection in our 35,000 square foot warehouse showroom. We're at 210 ProBet, open Monday through Saturday, 9.30 to 5 p.m. SA Specialties gives you your best prices on your AC and heating system change apps. Check out these great specials. Now is the time for the best prices of the year on our 14, 15, and 16 SEER systems. Call SA Specialties today at 210-658-0440 for your free estimate. Don't delay. Call today and start saving on your new AC and heating system. Call 658-0440 today. For all your AC, heating, and plumbing needs, call SA Specialties today. 
I'm Jeff Davis. Have you been hit by a commercial vehicle? Some vehicles carry $5 million in insurance. Some may carry up to $10 million. Often the insurance company won't tell you the maximum limits of their policy to try and hide the truth. But at Davis Law Firm, we won't let them get away with that. So if you're involved in an accident, call the fours immediately, and I will fight to get you the maximum cash settlement you deserve. Call me at 444-4444. That's 444-4444. That's right. There's only one number to remember, and that's four. So, I got news. Yeah? Remember the root canal we did? Yeah. Well, I'm going to have to drill it again. Drill again? Oh, there no. are some things in life you only want to do once like foundation repair. If your house is beginning to settle, don't settle for anything less than Ramjack Foundation Repair. Ramjack's American-made products are ISO certified and recognized by the International Code Council. Don't do it twice. Do it right. Rely on Ramjack. You're doing great, bud. Just keep it steady. When there are people who have your back, you can take anything on. At Aspen Dental, we always have your back. You did great, bud. Stop in for our grand opening. No insurance? Get a free new patient exam and x-rays. Call 1-800-ASPEN-DENTAL. Ready for office furniture? Desk Galore has new and used desks, chairs, file cabinets, bookcases, and much more. We have a big selection in our 35,000 square foot warehouse showroom. We're at 210 ProBet, open Monday through Saturday, 9.30 to 5 p.m. This is American Idol on ABC. American Idol auditions are coming to San Antonio, October 11th at the Hyatt Regency on the Riverwalk. Register online at AmericanIdol.com. Oh yeah. This fall treat. Mm-hmm. We asked folks earlier, what is your favorite fall treat? Julie says... The first day it gets cool enough, I make menudo. I don't eat it anywhere else, so I look forward to having this special treat during the cold months. Oh, good news. Julie shares. Ah. You share right this way, Julie. All the way to Market Square. Gabriella says a slice of banana. Oh, banana bread heated up with a piping hot cup of Pike Place roast coffee. Spread a little butter on that banana bread. Mm -hmm. ah, good stuff, Maynard. What are your banana bread? Del says, <laughs> Little Demby Pumpkin Delights. They are Ooh. soft, cookie-like snacks filled with pumpkin. It's like a pumpkin pie, just thin and small. So good. So, Del, you would actually really like the pumpkin pops we had on today's show because very similar. Yes, indeed. I just had Starbucks pecan spice. Hot. Was delicious. I haven't tried that yet. I have Pecan spice. Terry says a yes, pot yes, of yes. homemade beef stew on a cool fall evening. Are those finally here? <laughs> no, not yet. Fresh apple cider. Oh, that reminds From James. me of the place where I grew up, yes. Amanda says caramel apples. Oh, here you go. Like you, because um, mm -hmm. Mike likes caramel apples too. Or apple slices with caramel dip. Mm, mm. I do like apple slices with caramel dip. I know. They are very... Oh, hi. You're over here, Ted. Good to see you. Hey, coming up tomorrow on SA Live, right downtown, we are going to be taking you to the S San Antonio Fire Museum. Great place. They have got the historical fire trucks around there um, and so much history. It is, it's really inspiring. It's all volunteers and folks that used to be firefighters that volunteer there and some of the stories they can share. Um, it, it was really cool, you know, and, and of course, you know, what kid doesn't love a fire truck? So it's just the little kids and big kids looking around there. So it was, it was very interesting. It's right downtown. And you know what else kids like? How about some spooky treats for Halloween? How about brain and monster cupcakes with 350 Bakery? Look at those monster cupcakes. Ooh, You're gonna cool. eat them. Eat them before they eat you. <laughs> I need a caramel apple. Right? Yeah. Yeah, you do. I know. I'll go get a barrel and put some in there. And yeah. And again, remember you had to unwrap all the caramels? With the, you don't remember that? No. I get a bag of caramels and unwrap them. So that was always my job. And then my mom made the caramel apples. So. We'll see you tomorrow, Dwight.